Misha. Misha. And Royce's litter. Beautiful, beautiful tricolors. They're all tricolors. And uh, these guys are three weeks old now? Almost three weeks Almost old, three yep. Three weeks old. A couple days. And so now they are in um, with our, our, uh, our uh, flannel uh, mats on the floor and out of their pool. And uh, we always put a, a pad in here, a doggy bed, which they love to, to uh, curl up in. Beautiful, beautiful puppies. Just starting to see now, and they're starting to move around a little bit. And you can see this is their doggy door, but they'll be going out with it. We'll open it up when they're six weeks old. Just see how they're moving around a little bit. And I don't know if you can see, but we've got. Uh, We've got sheets up on the, the dividers just to make sure that uh, we keep this uh, a little bit warmer. The temperature comes up a little bit more. Um, we have a temperature for every week of their life that we like to maintain for them. And of course, mom can come in and out at will, which is really nice for her. You can just see the beautiful colors on these puppies. And their very temperaments are really, really nice. Misha, this is uh, Misha's. Uh, she's had, uh, um, this is, I think, her fifth litter, fourth, fourth litter, I think. This is her fourth litter. Um, she uh, she puts beautiful, beautiful coats on her girls and boys, and uh, and of course Royce. <laughs> He does that same thing. He has a beautiful, beautiful coat. They are just really nice family dogs, very outgoing, both mom and dad. And of course, everybody loves them. And they're just getting used to uh, toddling around and starting to become more, uh, more active and more responsive to, to uh, when you hold them and, and rub them. One of the little boys. And you can just see how, like I said, they're more responsive to when you're you're rubbing them, and and of course we do that in order to to uh, develop um, more neural pathways in them, uh, so that they are not as reactive but more responsive. We're always cautious to, when we put them down to make sure that we never put a puppy uh, down or let a puppy uh, um, loose uh, before they're they're comfortable because we want to leave them with a really good <laughs> a good uh, uh, good happy memory every time we we pet them every time we pick them up. So they always associate people with good things, not fear. And of course, fear is just not always a bad thing. Uh, but fear is part of uh, their instinct to keep them alive. And uh, we just we want them uh, to, uh, to uh, we want to modify that fear response. Nisha and Royce. Beautiful, beautiful litter. Really a gorgeous litter. Get any close-ups of them? Good. 